This is Paul Singh, the market speculator, with the trade report for Thursday, April 11, 2019. Let's look at SPY here. Opening green after a green day yesterday, basically holding the nine, which is good to see, and holding this 285 level. So SPY is at 288.47, about 288.50 right now. Uh, consolidating nicely. Hopefully, we get continue to get some consolidation. Uh, again, uh, while it's great to have a, a big move, uh, probably better to consolidate a little more before we make that run to the all-time highs. But SPY is looking good. Q's uh, looking good as well. And then IWM, again, red this morning. But yesterday actually was a good sign. Uh, we had the green day, and, and key for the Qs, or key for IWM, we held the nine and we held a remounted the 200 day moving average. So we want to stay above this level. Hopefully, IWM can do that, uh, but we're going to keep an eye on IWM. And then uh, the stocks above their 40 day moving averages went strong yesterday. But with this, it's more important to get a trend. So we'll see how that plays out. But we really want the Qs to improve. Oil is getting hit this morning a bit, down 0.67% to be expected after this big run. I would love to see a pullback here and then a show of strength uh, to be able to get back into oil, energy, uh, kind of similar pattern, but under its 200-day moving average. Semiconductors still overall strong. And uh, let's take a look at software. Software has been bouncing back some. Uh, still a little bit of mixed bag, but uh, we're, we're seeing some bounces in some of the uh, software stocks. And then financials, uh, green above the 200-day moving average. Current positions, we've got NVIDIA here sitting at 191.74, 65 now. Uh, we, wanted, we want this to hold the 9 EMA. Again, we entered at 179, so sitting at about 12 or 13 points right now. But we, we want to get that push here, uh, which would give us uh, a really nice reward to risk and obviously win as well. Netflix continuing to stall. We need to see it hold that 50-day moving average. Uh, let's Initially, I had to stop. A little lower at 355. I moved it up to 359, but now because the moving average is so close, uh, we might make it 357 to 358 uh, to stay above the 50-day moving average. So I've made a number of adjustments here to the stop on Netflix. Uh, haven't been hit yet, so that's good. But hopefully, we can get that push there. Uh, nail right around our entry point, consolidating here. Uh, above the uh, mo moving averages and then FCX uh, testing the 9 EMA. So that's the current positions. Focus list essentially remains the same. Uh, let's go over a few software stocks. You can see Twilio here bouncing off the 50. Now let's see if it remounts the 9, but it's looking pretty good. Coop is another good one here, already remounted its 9 and held its 50 day moving average. ILMN. Uh, remounted the 200 day and looks ready to make a run for maybe all time highs. ISRG, we were watching this all time high level. It broke it yesterday. I probably would have entered, but again, with four positions, I, I really wasn't looking to add yesterday. WWE, we've been watching, uh, looking good yesterday, making a run to highs. Win has made a big run. Now it's pulling back. We want to see that test of the nine if it can hold and start to bounce, then we'd get a really good bottoming formation continuation and a lot of room to the upside. Uh, FSLR solars were strong yesterday, led by FSLR, big breakout. I think this was on an analyst uh, upgrade. And we broke out here, now let's see how it consolidates, but we had a lot of sympathy plays like Run, looking very strong yesterday as well. Another solar uh, stock. And then of the fangs, Apple, uh, the best right now, holding its 9 EMA, and Amazon looking similar as well. So if you're looking for a current position to ent enter, uh, a lot of good candidates. Uh, again, not sure if I'm going to enter anything today. Maybe I might enter one, but uh, I'm happy with four positions right now.